There's a dime right there. What'd you get? Flower. You got flower? Yeah. Oh, that's sweet. Morning. Morning. I'm still Scooterlicious. Yes, you are. I think I'm going to be Scooterlicious for a while. What'd you get me? A little flower? Flower. Oh, you probably could if you want to. Well, you don't want to make that too big. But no, it's good. Or whatever. That's nice. Yeah. Uh, so we, we're just going to be here for a little bit because, you know, my ride. And I'm on call. Again. Oh, yeah. Cammy's on call again today, or this week. You weren't supposed to be on call, but this is where we we'll, um, So we're gonna, for sure, gonna get something to eat. Yes. Um, and kind of just hang out. And the parking guy, not the parking security uh, cast member, suggested that I eat a, a cream cheese pretzel. Right. So I'm gonna try for that if we can stay long enough for the uh, pretzel card to open. We'll see. And if not, we'll try it again another time. But, yeah. All right, let's go have a good time. See okay, you, soon. you You lead the way. Okay. And I'll, I'll scooter behind you. Okay. Okay, Sounds let's good. go. Oh, it's Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. Thank you. You're not my mom, but happy yeah. Mother's Day. are getting back to normal with Mickey Mouse and the in-person meet and greets. So you can get up close and say howdy doody. There's another penny. They're finding all kinds of stuff. Shoot. You're up 12 cents. That's 12 cents we found today. We found a dime walking in and two pennies. I wonder what that represents today. Of all days. Mother's Day. I said I wonder what that represents of all days today and Mother's Day. So we're inside the Emporium, still looking for camp shirts. Let's see what we see. Some characters from Red. And then the Electrical Parade is back for the 50th anniversary. So if you're 50, you're as old as the Electrical Parade. Oh, good catch, Pam. Wow. Well, look at they have wishables here to represent the Elliot the Dragon for the Electrical Light Parade. It, but, does, it doesn't have a magnet. See, they this is a lost opportunity right here because they could have made okay, it's seventeen dollars. We see that, but they could have put this batteries in here. They could have made it so that it lit up. You could have put it on your shoulder, like that. Could have been an awesome, awesome uh, souvenir for the parade. So Pam had a good idea. <laughs> See now she's like, what? <laughs> yeah, I'm not wearing pizza pie or anything. We came in here because we thought the men's store would have camp shirts. And although they have the one that we saw yesterday, it is a little too manly. That's it. That's the one I saw was the Hawaiian one. Oh, this is long sleeve. Oh, you know where else we can check the Tommy Bahama store over in uh, Adventure Land? Okay. Okay, we'll go there. Pam, look. You're not going to believe this. Thirteen. Dude. Thirteen cents. Wow. You're just too low to the ground. I, yeah, that's it. <laughs> My scooterlicious self is too low to the ground. Well, there's the same one. Oh, oh, look at this one. That one's cute. You like this one? Well, yeah, but that's gonna be over 100 bucks. Yeah, it is. So it's at 130. Yeah, we might as well go to this one. Atlantis. That one's 30, 130, 130 also. They're all 130 in here, wow. except for that Hawaiian one. Oh. 
We don't want blue again. I wanted mine blue, but still 130. Because it's Tommy Bahamas, huh? Yeah. That's a little out of my price range. Yeah, and that one's 60. Ooh. Look at that, that's cute. Tell me Bahamas. Yeah, it's expensive. 130. These are all 130. This doesn't even show anything else on it. Nope. Hmm, well that's disheartening. All right, let's go hunt down some breakfast. And then I need to buy one of those today Okay, so for uh, your nephew you, for his birthday. Are we going to the Red Tavern? Is that where Wherever you, Red you want to go. Okay. I wanted to go to the Grand Californian, but I have to agree, I think that might be a little too much to pedal. To scoot. Pam suggested we go into the Pioneer Mercantile. See what we can see here. Oh. I almost became a statistic. Good morning. So they have this one again, which we might be stuck with that. You have this one already? We none, none of us have it. There go. All right, let me go get it. I notice they have a new happy birthday ears, set of ears. Pam's not too fond of wearing those on her birthday, but you know, I'm game. This is not scooter friendly. There's only one way off. It's only one way off, so I have to scoot it. If I don't face plant first. Here we go. None of these here trails in frontier land are scooter friendly. We got bumps and footprints and me. Dang, I came to Disneyland to get a workout. Good golly. She's hiding in the bushes. Who's hiding? Oh, I see her there hiding in the bushes. She is right there. Oh, she's yeah. She's probably sitting on some eggs. Yeah, she looks like she's kind of puffed out. Well, I look puffed out too, and I'm not sitting on no eggs, but she looks puffed out. And then Pam noticed that the baby daddy over here, he's just making himself pretty. And she's looking at him with just, it's Mother's Day. It's Mother's Day, and here I am sitting on some eggs. And you out there, boy. She got three eggs, or I mean three chicks. Oh, she's eating. So we're here at the Red Rose Caverns. Pam went inside to go get breakfast. I'm sitting here and what do I see? Another penny on the ground. I'm going to try to hobble over there and get it. Pam's back. Hi. What'd you get Pam? I got you a breakfast bowl with tater tots and, oh, and tater. bacon switches for the sausage. Okay cool because I know you like that better. Yeah I like that better. That's cool. This is strawberry sauce. Oh I was wondering what that was. I'm like why would you put ketchup on a... I know it's what I thought it was too. Wow. So, nice. yeah. Enjoy. Happy Mother's Day. Thank you. I'm sorry you had to go in to go get it. No, that's okay. I'm thinking, oh my God, the only thing that's going to make it worse is if she gets a phone call. Oh, yeah, I was worried. About I was that. like, oh my God, please don't let the phone ring because. Yeah, no problem. Yeah. Because right. then I would have left the line. And we would've yeah, you would have had to have left the line. Yeah, for sure. We would have not eaten. <laughs> <laughs> would have been churro breakfast. Hey, we got entertainment while we're eating breakfast. Nice. Well, marching entertainment. It's the pearly band. Hey. Well, that was a nice little cadence. 
for you to chew by. The electrical light pin. Thank you. Have a good day now. What'd you get? Oh. Bubbles. You got a book for who? For Bo. Baby nephew? Yeah. He's gonna be two. I'll be two this month. He loves bubbles. Yeah, he loves bubbles. Yeah, we'll have to take a video of that and, uh, when he gets it. So, all right. They have colored popcorn. Except for that colored popcorn. Ooh. Look at that, electrical parade popcorn. Wow. That looks pretty yummy. If you like the sweet and salty, you know, taste together, I'm not too into the confetti popcorn, but no. for a sweet and salt, like if it was caramel, but it was caramel, yeah. it was a different color. Yeah. But caramel's caramel, that's why it's called caramel, because of the caramel color. So, Alright, let's hit it. Oh, there comes my boyfriend. Hookity hook. Swans, the topiaries. They're that's pretty. different, yeah, that's different. Right, I gotta keep both hands on the wheel. Yeah, you do. I'm gonna become a statistic. It's a Disneyland After Dark grad night reunion. Huh. I never came here for grad night. Did you? I did. Yeah? I did you did. stay for the whole night? <laughs> did you get kicked out yes. of Disneyland? <laughs> Were you up to shenanigans? Yes. <laughs> I was a bystander. Oh, you were innocent? Yeah. Innocent bystander? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Okay. I believe you. Sure, hold on to it. Okay. Thank you. Oh, happy Mother's Day. Thank you. Same to you. Yeah, my little fur baby. <laughs> I've had several over the years. So, could you imagine being a kid bringing your mom here for Mother's Day? Oh, no. No, no. My mother would have said, no, we're going to Grandma's house. Yeah. Because that's what we did for every holiday. Yeah, we did that too. That was amazing when I was a kid. Do you have a favorite Mother's Day that you can remember? Whether you, it was for your mom or whether uh, your boys did for you? No? No. Just I mean, family get together. Just family stuff, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I was lucky. I had uh, a mom and a stepmom. And uh, so, it's like you, because, you know, I grew up a long time ago. That on Sundays, we would just go to my grandma's house. Like, that was an everyday thing. And then Mother's Day, it was like, you know, they got flowers. Mm -hmm. That was always a good time. And then when I moved away, um, you know, that was harder, obviously, to have, you know, family on Sunday. But mm -hmm. uh, back when I first moved here, though, like my mom would say, 
call on Sunday, that's when the rates are the cheapest because that was before cell phones, before it was like, I think that was like the first step right after Morse code. <laughs> you had to call on Sundays. On the party line. <laughs> my grandma had a party line. My grandma on my dad's side had a party line. We had a party line when we lived up in the desert. Did you really? Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. And my stepmom, so my favorite, my favorite memory from my stepmom, I guess, um, okay, I have so many because she didn't have to like me. <laughs> I was not the sweetest uh, child with the best disposition like I am today. Um, but I remember being a kid that uh, she would take me trick-or-treating. Like she would take, and she would take my sister and, um, you know, the, the cousins. Uh, you know, we all went together in one big group. But she didn't have to do that. But mm -hmm. she did. You know, she stopped by, picked me up grab the pillowcase and mm -hmm. let's go trick-or-treating and then bring me back you know a few hours later so that for some reason Halloween reminds me of her in that respect you know and she always checked up on me it was always good and with my mom of course you know nobody can replace your mom it's mm -hmm. just it's just one of those there's too many memories to even choose from you know right including our our last visit here to the park a couple years ago but anyway all my family out there and I'm sure Pam's family too we wish you all a happy Mother's Day and until we circle back around which is it's still it's a few weeks away mm -hmm. uh, I won't be I probably won't have the scooter I think our next visit is in June actually and hopefully I won't have the scooter then but anyway we'll catch you later see you soon